Contested. Hey guys, it's Nora from Tested. I'm here with Ashley at the HTC booth. Now I needed a hand lower for this because I can't actually touch this. Can't touch this. It's the HTC Evo 3D, the sequel to the very popular Evo 4G. Now this is also a 4G phone, uh, but it is quite advanced, way more advanced than the Evo 4G from last year. First of all, it is a 4.3 inch QHD. Now QHD is a little bit of a marketing term. 960 by 540, one fourth of resolution. A 1080p, very similar to the Motorola Atrix that we already have at the office. Uh, but this is running dual core 1.2 gigahertz processors, the latest Snapdragon from Qualcomm. HTC has always had the best partnerships with Qualcomm, so it's glad great to see that they have the newest processor. And of course, because it's HTC, it's running HTC Sense UI, technically 3.0, they don't really call it that, it's the newest version. And some of the new features, when you turn it on, the lock screen, you can actually immediately jump to any of the apps you want. Let's go jump to mail. So you can highlight mail, and uh, it will launch the mail client. Or if you swipe it up, it'll just go to the home screen. Uh, pretty intuitive. And uh, much like uh, the HTC Flyer, it has the carousel mode, so if you swipe all the way across, you, can, you don't hit a dead end at the end of the apps. Uh, but that's Android, this is Gingerbread. You've seen it before. Let's show you what's really, really cool about the Evo 3D, the 3D part. So on the back of the phone, actually, there are two five megapixel cameras, two of them, so you can shoot and take pictures, video and pictures in 3D, 1080p video in 3D. Let's actually take a look at that. So you launch the camera app. So we'll go into the gallery, and we'll pick some videos. Yep. And we can actually show us, here's some videos they've actually shot before already. Uh, there's HDMI out if you want to connect this to your TV. I know you guys won't be able to see the 3D, but I can vouch for it. It is 3D. Here is the Green Hornet trailer. If I stand in front of it, straight on, I do see 3D. Uh, because the screen resolution is 960 by 540, it's actually like, much higher than what you see in the 3DS. The 3D actually looks much sharper. There's less interlacing in the lenticular display. Unfortunately, there is no uh, software or hardware adjustment right now for the 3D, so you really just have to move it away from you, close to you. You know, about 12 to 14 inches is going to be the best. Um, for uh, viewing images or video in 3D. But you can shoot video, and it's great. No glasses like the LG site, you have to wear those you know, red and blue glasses. Here, it actually just works on screen. So there is no pricing or uh, availability announcement. This is just announced today, um, but we assume it will be up for Sprint. That's what it says. Yep, it's so Sprint this summer. This summer, if you're waiting for a 3D phone, take 3D pictures, HGC's Evo 3D. Check it out this summer. I'm Norm from Tested. See you guys next time. More coverage from CTIA.